Again, parents of the Parkland victims turning their anger into action, some vowing to change the face of the school board in this election. Local 10's Glenna Milberg is live with their message. Glenna. Because of those parents turned candidates, Nicole, these school board races, five of them in Broward, they're down ballot races, usually pretty obscure. And now this one has national attention and people really keying in here at early voting on really how important and critical the decisions that a school board makes. So whether these parents win or lose, they have no doubt already been game changers. Among the campaigns here, two parents whose profound loss is driving their bids for seats on the Broward School Board, the they feel so we'll failed them. With, we'll start with leadership. We'll start with defining priorities and a vision for what we want the schools to, to be here in Broward County. Elena's dad, Ryan Petty, and Alyssa's mom, Lori Aladef, have developed into skilled candidates. Hopefully there's low-hanging fruit we can get to first and then tackle the harder and more difficult and challenging issues. In the five school board races, four candidates have connections to Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High. Because we were so laid back and comfortable and we're making changes now after the fact. When it hits home, you know, it very, very, very directly affects your outlook and how you move, how you look at policy in terms of school board. No doubt the parents have moved voters. They are the very reason Vanessa Camargo decided to become a U.S. citizen.